So what I, what I want to do is I want to try to watch some replays that don't exist anymore in the game. Okay, it worked, guys. Look at that. Nice. Poggers, yes. So this is a file on my computer. And we made it work. Okay, beautiful. So this was the first game we played in the tournament. Which was me and Astromia, Winter and uh, versus Pepino and Winter. Um, oh, look at the map. That's actually funny. Where are they? them in the map? <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. I thought it was but for a second. Cool. So here I am playing my Byzantines and Astromia playing her Japanese. I'm just going to go a little bit faster. I just want to think about our decisions and how we decided to play against them. So Japanese normally goes fast castle, right? And one one thing that you always want to think about is if they go fast naked castle, you can just mess units and harass them. And that was my role in this game. So I just go normal with my little cistern and I think she's gonna go just fast castle as well. In winter as Ottoman, she should have the role of playing Feudo and trying to hold me back. That's um, my opinion. That's how she should play this. Um, and let her teammate just go fast castle, you know. So Ottoman should keep me busy. Can be challenging, yeah, because I'm busy things and it's uh, a little bit of a challenging sieve uh, to stop. But oh my god, look how much sheep I got. Ah. That's a lot of sheep. Okay, so Nostromia decides to go for dogs and the Ottoman starts already to harass here. And again, that's our role, right? To protect our teammate so they can fast castle. So it also makes spears to defend. Ba -ba -ba -ba. We do a little dance here and there with the spears. Just keep her busy. I saved that one. And that's what Japanese is actually doing. As you can see, there's a tower in the gold, and normally indicates that, and there's a lot of people. The sermon doesn't even have a tower. I mean, there's not really much that can hurt her, right? There are only some spears from Ottomans here. So, she doesn't really need the tower anyway, it's okay. And I'm starting to make some longbows and continue, produ continue to produce some spears. Okay, let me drink this thing. Ay. If anyone has any questions, can just uh, type in the chat. It's just... Um, Miss my mouth, I guess. <laughs> I have drink everywhere now. Anyway, so I start to send my spears forwards, right? Because uh, forward, because I want to harass Japanese. I don't want them to be fast castle. I mean, they can, it's hard to stop castle, but I want her to be at least not not at the same point as my teammate. I want my teammate to be in a better position than the other Japanese. So I just test the waters a bit to see she's um, she's looking. And just waste her time. <laughs> Meanwhile, I try to eat all the berries I can instead of farms so I can make more units. She is already castle. Pepino is castle. Starting to make some knights. And I'm bringing my longbows. And we just keep her scout active. This, this is what I can see now. So now I'm gonna I'm gonna go for the gold. And what this is gonna cause is even though both are castle, she's gonna have to keep her units here, right? Because of me. And meanwhile, Nostromia is taking relics, has her knights running around, she has freedom, and I'm keeping Japanese busy. 
What I missed was I forgot the shield wall and I remember because you know when I realized in the game that I forgot that I was like oh god I could have lost uh, way less spearmen there so you always want to activate that oh I, I get I see this and I kill with my villagers nice little pick there oh, look at them carrying their little berries okay meanwhile we just I just literally moved here we just keep going Okay. She tries to harass me here with the with the knights, but I see it. I think I see. Yeah, I see it, and I immediately j just move my villagers, and I go to. The <laughs> I actually yolo a little bit, and I go for this. I'm like, ah, I don't have anything to deal with this, and I didn't want to be idle forever, so I just moved there. I also scouted. Where's my scout? Yeah, I scouted these villagers here already. Punished them for that. And, this is also something we saw here with the scout, that's why it's so important to keep scouting. Or at least keep the scout in an inter interesting position that can give some good information, right? And this was, like, extremely valuable. She cancelled her landmark here, and then we keep going. Yeah, my A move here, that's frustrating, but what ends up happening is... She can't age up, right? Because we are all over her. My longbows are just cleaning up stuff. And this happens again. She cancelled twice her landmark. That's really bad. Just kind of GG there, I guess. Meanwhile, I'm eating that. And yeah. That's a lot of damage, right? You can see my team has 96 uh, equal. I think this game was pretty much fine. It's it's hard to say much. Japanese constantly idle. Right? And we did enough damage on Oto, so we just decided to move on and go to, to Japanese and just sit on their face. Oh I remember this moment. I was I had two spears there, right? But I I was in shock that I saw so many knights from from Nostromia under the Wololo. And during the game I was like, Nostromia, your knights, your knights will no move, move, move. <laughs> I was like panicking that we were gonna lose all those knights to the Wololo. Um that would have been really bad. Um and sometimes, you know, you need some time to understand because of the English or the language barrier and stuff, but she moved them and was fine. I keep sitting here, just annoying them, but I am aging up and I decide to just back off a bit and I think um, I just wanted to make rams, I was like I'm not gonna dive that, we did so much damage already, there's no hurry, we're chilling, and Ostrom is killing Ottomans meanwhile because Otto army was in Japanese space. So you can kind of abuse this uh, lack of mobility of one of the players, right? So Ottoman is mostly in infantry. So once you see that their army is here in the in the teammate's base, you go ahead and push them. And until they arrive with the units, with their immobile units, it's um, they they lose a lot, right? So that's kind of the idea. I see the towers have now emplacement. And then we are chilling. I just sit in front of Japanese base to scare them off to drop some rams. Meanwhile, she's cleaning Ottoman. She's Imperial now. And it's a destruction. It's just a destruction. I start to make some rams, but it's not even... The game's already over. I was just making rams for fun to make some barbecue, I guess. I was like, I'm gonna make as many as possible, but I was lacking a bit of um, gold, as you can see. I had too much food, and it's hard to control the the food from from Byzantines. I feel like you always end up with so much food. I say that in Japanese is in the same situation, <laughs> but I feel like with Byzantines, when you start to drop the farms, you just mass food so fast. It's it's insane. I have only 19. 
She has 30. You know? And we have like... Um, okay, I have a lot of... I have even more military, so I'm using more. I mean, despite the oil. It's not considered oil, but it's still... Maybe that's one of the reasons, right? And queuing gauge. And she sent me more food! <laughs> I didn't ask for that, guys. She was like, oh, I have too much. Do you need food? Um, no. Okay, I'll send you. <laughs> she was super sweet. Okay. Well, and from here, we killed Japanese. Nostromia killed Otto. And that. GG. That was our first game. Clap, clap. And Ozutsu just destroying as well.